Hello everybody, welcome back to more Mugger 3. Last episode, we arrived at the tower of whatever, and today we're going to finish it, hopefully. And here we have a returning enemy from Earthbound called Octobot, I don't know if you remember. But yes, Octobot's in this game, and I feel like we've been here before. Um, here's a little maze area, let's see, super bomb. Can't carry any more stuff. Uh, whatever, I'm just gonna skip out on that because we don't think we really need it. So, ooh, let's see who this chick is. No problem here, sorry. Nice person, hot spring. Thank you, nice person, respect, nice broke in your heart. Right, vitalized, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so we have this creepy area. Your attention, please. You appear quite exhausted there, Lucas, but real fun's about to begin. Climb the stairs up ahead. Come, don't disappoint me now. <laughs> ah, Pokey, you're a real weirdo. Uh, let me save here. Right. Let's save. Okay, we're good. Alright, let's go. Then, boom. And, boom. Alright, let's talk to you. Master Lucas and friends, I have been waiting for you! I've changed my hat, so perhaps you don't recognize me. But I was the chauffeur of that difficult to drive and far too long limousine. I'm pleased to see you've made it this far. I will now determine if you're fit to meet with Master Porky or not. Kindly follow me if you would. Alright, let's go in here. Alright. Master Pokey just loves to play fun games, so I'll use this super whack-a-mole game to judge whether or not you're fit to be a wonderful playmate of his. This is why I'm explain the wonderful worlds. A button hammers will win the game. Master Pokey also loses or the word win. If the words indulge and humor mean anything to you, you know what to do. But if you try to throw the match, Master Pokey will be very displeased indeed. Okay, do you understand now? Yes, I do. Hit the old guy in the helmet and you'll be zapped. Do you try to be careful? Alright, let's bring out the Master Lucas competitor, Master Mini Porky. Alright, so pretty much our main goal in this game is to lose at these games. That way, uh, Master Porky gets angry. So he's gonna let this guy do his thing. Alright, simply amazing, you hit a grand total of 10 moles. Alright, you're up, Master Lucas. So now it's our turn. And we can't hit anybody. Boink. 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 Alright. Boink. Oops, sorry. Come on, give me somebody. Doink. Oops, my B. Alright. Ah, don't let me hit. It's not letting me hit. Alright. Alright, come on. Alright. Got you. Uh oh, what's how many we hit? Oh, we got 11. Oops. You all worked up and then you bang, 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 bang. I thought you had a blood break. Let me see your eyes. Well, they're bloodshot. I'm afraid I can't introduce some of the You can match up. Try again. This time. Okay, so pretty much we have to lose on purpose. So I'm gonna try to get one. One. Sorry. One. Um. See, we can't lose too badly. I think that'll like make us do it again. Two, three, uh, four. Oops, maybe. Four, mm, five, six, seven. I almost hit that guy. Oh, okay, come on. Eight, nine. So I'll just stay with that. I'll just run them around for a bit. I think we got nine. All right, we got nine. All right. Oh my, mini Master Pokey won the attempt to match by Razor Thin. One mole. What a wonderful game. Truly heart stopping. Now then, let's move on to the next one inside the game. So pretty much, she's our opponent. Um, I can save here if I want to. I could do this. All right. Let's go. Let's go up these stairs. All right. Alright, we're getting inside. Here we have race. This one's pretty fun. Next is the purple bridge race game. The goal to start 
At the same time, the reach, the rules, and dodge and divulge. Perhaps the former would be one focus on. Give you catch my drift, do you understand? Yes. Alright. So we're ready, get on your starting position. On your mark, get set. Go! Go! Alright, we have to let him win this. Whoa! Mini match book, you win an intense match by the nose. What truly fantastic race? That match is 28 and not let him win until the third and final game. Pretty much, it can't be too far unless I think they'll make you restart the game, anyways. So you gotta keep, like, letting them win. It's the only way to keep moving and fast forward. I'm pretty sure you can't, like, forcefully lose the game. Pretty much, you have to let them be on the other side, so. Okay, let's go. Let's go up here. At last, we're at the final game. Please come this way. What? Alright, so my B. Alright, let's see what this game is. So the final game is To Whom Goes the Boom. Alright, here are the quick explanation of the rules. Use your mental A button air pump to quickly inflate your balloon until boom. The first to pop his balloon wins. Do you understand the rules now, right? Yes, we do. Let's go to your position. Alright, so we're gonna have to blow up a balloon. This is pretty much Mario Party. Alright. So, let's see who can win this. Ready? Set? Go! Alright, I'm just gonna go super slowly. Oh, he got it first. Oosh, I lost. Oh no. Oh, my B. Oh, what happened? Do you want me to do it again? Alright, I think his popped behind me. Oh, my B. Okay, that happened. Clap, clap, clap. You're so young, eh? You mastered so much. I hereby deem you fit to meet Master Pokey. Now then, please go and pay Master Pokey a visit. Alright, so we're on our way now. Let's go this way. I might want to save. Right, that's good. Just be careful out there. Next round we meet. Okay. Whoa! Lucas, welcome to my room. This is the real one on the floor that you've been wanting to come to oh so badly. Again, I welcome you, my beloved decibel pets. I was the one who invited you here. You've come, so you're free to come inside if you wish. It's just, I give an order to let no one into my room. So a little attack toy I sent you right here. Who knows, maybe this guy will say goodbye and I invited you here. Alright, let's turn it on. Hello to natural killer, Cyborg. Alright. We have the natural killer cyborg, and he's huge! Okay, starting off, you might want to lower all of his attacks. Um. Okay, so what we're gonna do is raise up all our stats. So let's do that. Um. Let's defense down. Tickle stick and let's sniff, I guess. So like the character come out. Weak against lightning. Pretty much he's always weak against lightning. So always we get hit. Now we're getting all the defense up. Alright, he's gonna do our first attack. And then, oh my goodness, this is really devastating. Alright, now I'm gonna put up some shields, so. Alright, now it's time for. PK Thunder. Right. All right, we got this. Oh, man. Oh, damn. Alright. There we 
Alright, looks like we're gonna be taking a lot of damage. I'm gonna start healing myself. Alright. Let's do this, come on. Come on. And I think Boney- oh, Boney's alive. Good. Okay, this is gonna be kind of easy, hopefully. Whoa! Okay. Um. Let's see. All right. I am sorry. I'm being kind of quiet. I am trying to know what to do right now. Mm. All right. Let's raise up our. Defense, Matora, lower his attack, and just have you know everybody bash it by whatever. All right, let's go turn. All right, just and he auto heals himself. Okay, GG. I'm gonna have everybody get healed, so do that. Wait. Mm, okay, this should be good. Mm, and uh, this should be good. I'll go for the tickle stick, and once again, I'll go for the. Okay, I'll go for a fork stew on myself. Alright, that's good. Oh. Two. Three. Alright. Just to make sure we're automatically healed. Alright. Mm. This music is pretty kick ass. I don't know if you guys can hear that. Alright. I'm gonna go for the counter. And I'm gonna keep going for thunder. Hopefully that I kill them. Alright. Hopefully we're getting somewhere. Come on. This guy's a chimera, so he's pretty much vulnerable and everything. Alright. Yes, that was good. <laughs> what a loser. Alright. I'm gonna keep doing my strategy here and hopefully I can still win this. Alright. Okay. Oh, I think I did the wrong thing. Alright, good. Alright. Aw, oh, man. There we go. Alright. Come on, kill everybody. Good. And my thing is gone, so I'm going to put that back. Yes, and he was defeated. Alright, pretty much all you have to do is lower his offense, raise all your stats, and use thunder moves, and try to live as long as possible. Otherwise, this fight is pretty difficult. So, yes. Alright. Alright, I want to see if I could, like, save here, because just in case I end up do dying in the next fight. I much rather save here. All right, so let's go. Mm -hmm. So we're going to this very long room, and if you listen to this music, it's Mother One, or in this case, Earthbound Zero's theme. It's really nice to hear, actually. This room is really long. Damn, it's really nostalgic, actually. 
Dun. Okay, enough of that. More nostalgia is about to come. Let's get in here. Pour on the boat. All right. So we're here. We're going. We are going to hear Pollyanna's theme. Da 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 dun dun dun. See all these Earthbound references right here. Um, it's really nice actually. We have Tessie or Nessie, whatever her name was. I forgot. I'm so sorry. We have our dad in the background. We have the Skyrocketer. You know, all this the pencil eraser, eraser, eraser. The uh, the helicopter, Dungeon Man. We have also the bus, some buses, an ATM, uh, the yellow submarine, Beatles, uh, bike, I think that's Nessie's bike, and the Saturn thingy, I forgot, and we have that, the Mr. Mr. Fucking Pokey's chair thing, and I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be the fly in the fleet, in the feet, whatever her name is, the fly that came to tell Ness about the future and all that. It's really nice, and I think this is Ness's house in the boat. So it's really nice hearing the song. <laughs> Got a pencil eraser, GG. <laughs> like funny. Alright. Let's put our save. Thank you. Okay. Let's do this too. Alright, we're fully revitalized. I think we're ready to go forward. Let's go. <clears throat> this looks really spooky. Oh. It's raining. The beginning of the end. The end of everything. Pokey. Tim. Let's be friends. I'm Porky. I am really just a sneak little boy. Please don't over me more. Please talk to me like good boys and girls, just like me. Thanks. But, to be honest, you guys are nothing but pests for me. Oh dear. We gotta fight all of these! Pretty much, don't on, Duster! Come on! No, oh, Duster's gonna die! And all to Ness. I mean, oops, Lucas. Ah, man, more of these. We had a difficult fight. All of a sudden, some guys rushed into the room. Who is this? It was DCMC! Bakio jumped out on front. Tom DeGasso, dramatic climaxes were on really dudes got to shine. Bakio attacks. Boom! I think this Master Pokeway was trying to brainwash everyone. Let's say tie down to screw this idiotic plan. Shimmy Zimmy Zack tax. So this guy's dead. So pretty much they are going to kill the robots for us. And that was an intense battle. Oh my gosh. Really intense. Come, Boney. This is it. Lucas, this is finally it. How have we managed to corner the enemy or have we been dragged here? So suppose it doesn't matter either way. Right, Duster? Hmm. <laughs> Come a little closer so I can see your face better. Oh, that's what you look like. I was the one who brought you here. Traveler has journeyed and from past and future. I am the most clever, most charming, and most troublemaking boy ever. Master Porky Mitch. It was you. This whole time, it was you. Well, I welcome you just again. Your weak hangers are pretending to be the worst survivors in the world. Spankity, spankity, spankity. Ha 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 ha. It's him. That's Pokey. Or Porky in this game. <laughs> Resort to blanking your memories to create a new world where humanity's past failures will never be repeated. How stupid can you be? No matter how much you change the rules, no matter how much you refuse to admit defeat, in the end, creatures known as people will always sign their death warrant by acting out of stupidity and evil. And then mankind will be gone for good. And you have, could have been happy if only you w would have done as what I did and obediently followed the visionary, selfish desires of a great hero. <sighs> <sighs> Why is he struggle to cling with life with such creamy minds, pitiable bodies, and fearable hearts? 
What a matter, the curtain is about to fall on this pathetic little play of yours because soon the power will be mine. The world and everything has been in my oyster so far, and now it will end by acquiring the ultimate power. <laughs> Aha! Ugh, man, he's coughing and gasping. Whew. Everything so far has been fun and games. I can give you a concussion. I don't know. I was born out of my mind and want to see something more thrilling, and now over face to face like this, I couldn't hold any back. My slave. My lightless son will pull the final needle for me, and the moment he does, the dragon should awaken and do what I want. At which time, I assume he fool to turn into garbage or dust or something. Finally disappear for good. <laughs> I'll admit, this is kind of sad, but I will be crushed under the weight of boredom if it were in it other other way. Ugh. We use gas, gas, gas. You stand around. Do you understand the sadness, Master Porky Bear? Not only that he's gone like. <laughs> he's pretty much gonna kill himself. What's going on? Oh, you love your little dramatic place. So this is a we're gonna not come at a better time for you. It seems the seventh and final needle has been located deep underground below here. I refuse to help you anymore. Ah ha! Wah ha! Ha ha ha! I assume you want to pull it too, Lucas. Why don't you go out and check it then? I even being fair enough to tell you where it is. That would really make this game the more fun. But I think I'll use my shortcut to give myself a head start if you don't mind. <laughs> cough, cough, wheeze, wheeze, gasp, gasp. Bring it on if you can catch up to me, that is. Here, you can use this elevator all you want. Spankity, spankity, spankity. Gasp, gasp, gasp. Oh, and we're on our way down. Flint came with us too, surprisingly. And this elevator is going really fast! Oh man, what's going on? Lucas! Lucas, there's something that me concerned. Can you let me go on her first? Yes. Thanks, don't ask why. But if it seems I've gone a long time, go ahead and keep going. Alright, so... We're gonna have to follow our dad. Um, see where everybody is. Hmm. Sorry? I'm gonna check stats. I check stats. There we go. Oh, everybody has one HP. Might as well heal everybody up. Alright. Mm. Alright, we're all good. Wanna go? Do we really wanna go? Should we? I mean, this is the final area of the game. Let's see where everything is. This is a way down. Do we get a map? Anything? Alright, let's check this way. There's no enemies here, surprisingly. I assumed everything would be, like, very loud. What's this? It's not loud. It seems familiar. Doorknob. So the doorknob? Hmm. There's a save frog here. Underground. Please be careful. Next frog we meet. So what's in here? Hot spring! Ah, so nice. What's this? And we have some enemies here. I see you're scared. Alright. Hmm. The final area of the game. Whoa. Okay, I guess this is like an inverted place. And I'm getting attacked. GG, okay. Oh, the, Miller the Miller Eye. Whatever this thing is. Hmm. You better run. Looking near us. We're good. We're godlike. Uh, 
All right, scrub. Let's get you. You're dead too. Hmm. Something about this is has me like really weirded out. In a barking. Oh my God, Flint's hat. Oh, Flint, you okay? Hmm, that masked man. He's Klaus. Lucas, he's your brother. Klaus, I don't know why he's obeying this porky guy, but as a father, I finally found the son I lost. Lucas, be happy. I finally found your brother. Oh.